there, I'm Hannah with Truly Nolan and I am here to tell you about our different free printable activities that are available on our website if you go to www.trulynolan.com and up in that top portion click on about us and if you scroll down on the left hand side you'll find our free printable activities. One of those that I'll show you today is our clothespin grasshopper and there's an example of that PDF that you'll find there to download. We'll go through a couple of the quick steps to make your adorable clothespin grasshopper with just a few different supplies. So you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you have a clothespin. Um, I have a already painted green one here, but you're more than welcome to go ahead and just paint a regular clothespin at home. And then some green pipe cleaners. I've cut a light colored pipe cleaner in half, and then I've got half of a darker one to use for their antennas as well some little stick on googly eyes, as well as some tacky glue. All right, we'll go ahead and get into making that clothespin grasshopper. So you're going to take your clothespin and your dark green um, half of a pipe cleaner, go ahead and pinch open that clothespin and place that inside. Then you're gonna go ahead and pinch that up toward the top so it's done at about half on each side. And then pinch and twist about three times. And then once you've got that, you're more than welcome to go ahead and bend those edges over to give your grasshopper a little flare for his antenna. Then we're gonna go ahead and work on making our legs. So let's go ahead and start with our full size pipe cleaner here. You're gonna wanna bend that in half. And then we're making an M with this, remember? So go ahead and bend the other side back and half down, leaving a little extra to give it that foot right there. And then do the exact same thing on the other side. And we're gonna do this two more times with our smaller pipe cleaners. I'm gonna try and do that quick for you guys. And remember, this does not have to be perfect. It is all about being creative with this. There we go. So we've got our three separate sets of legs. Now we're gonna go ahead and start with one of our small sets here. And you're going to go ahead and open up that clothespin, go ahead and slide that in, and then push that pipe cleaner up, just like that. And that's gonna give you your first set of legs there. And then you'll take your second smaller set of legs and put that right there along with your antenna just like that. And that'll stay in place pretty well. If you would like, you can put some tacky glue on there too to give it a little extra stability. Then we'll go ahead and we're going to put our eyes on first. That makes it a smidge bit easier. So quick little tip for you guys so that when you're gluing on your back legs, you don't run into any problems. So I put the eyes right here at the front of the clothespin let me go ahead and get the other one. I've got the little peel and stick kind, but any type of um, googly eyes will work. And then you go ahead and put that second guy there. So he's got his sweet little face. <laughs> and then for that last bit, we'll go ahead and take our tacky glue and put a dollop right on top of the springs at the back. And then with our final set of legs, you wanna go ahead and grab both of those feet and pull them back like this. That's gonna create the hopping motion of your grasshopper, okay? So then take that last set of legs, go ahead and push that all the way to the back and push them up, give them a little pinch. And there you go. You've got a cute little grasshopper to play with while you're at home. You can check out some of our other free printable activities on trulynolan.com. And remember to stay safe out there and have a good one. Bye-bye now.